Good morning, YouTube. It's the Scorpion. Yes, I said good morning. I just got finished watching Whitney Houston on Good Morning America. And as bad as Whitney sounded, I still enjoyed the performance. Like, all songs I enjoy. Million Dollar Bill, I Look to You, I'm Every Woman, and My Love is Your Love. And you know, My Love is Your Love, Whitney had me cracking up. Because I'm like, no, she is not talking these lyrics out. Like, she was actually talking the lyrics out. And then she made Bobby Christina sing. And then she was like, I got my baby. Me and Bobby's baby. And at first it sounded funny to me. Because I'm like, I know she ain't say that. But she said it like three more times. And then I was like, you know what? Whitney is still a rider for Bobby Brown. And you know what? That's all right with me. That she can still sing about him. Even though she's divorced from him. You know, she got something beautiful from that relationship. Bobby Christina. But back to the album. You know, Whitney sang I Look To You. Her mother was out there. Whitney was crying. Her mother was crying. The crowd was crying. Her voice was crying, you know, like, please don't, I look to you, Whitney, girl, Whitney did not sell as good as she sound on that CD, so I know something ain't right, but so what, it's Whitney Houston, like I said, Whitney Houston and Britney Spears, like I said on Twitter, they're the only ones that can give me bad performances, because I understand, like, what they've been through, they've been through a whole lot, and for them to still perform and to still have their lives, that's a blessing from God. God did not take everything from them, you know, they, they're not as good as they used to be, but you know what, they're still here, they're still pressing on, and they're going on with their lives, and they're still sharing their lives with us, but they could have just walked away from it all. Back to Whitney Houston. I know I done brought up Britney. But, you know, like, I really, really, like, I'm really, really happy for Whitney Houston that she's giving us a new CD. She's opening up, you know, to Oprah Winfrey. Oh, my God. Did y'all see the commercial? Two hours. Two freaking hours on with Not, yeah. On Oprah. She's going to talk about the sex, the drugs. Losing the voice and everything. I cannot wait. Oprah, you done got me hyped for this interview. And you didn't even give Whitney Houston an audience. So it was just one-on-one -on -one talking to each other. Like, I really cannot wait to see this. Now, I want to know, what did y'all think about Whitney Houston's performance? I know some of y'all probably wanted me to get up on this camera. Cursing Whitney Houston out is not going to happen. We all know her voice can't go to the lengths that it used to go. But be honest, like, was it bad? Was it horrible? Should she have lip synced? Like, let me know what y'all think Whitney should have done. I'll be replying to some of your comments. If you have not subscribed to The Scorpion Show, subscribe to The Scorpion Show. We are about to hit 17,000 subscribers, and I hope we hit it today. So if you ain't clicked that yellow button located on the right of this video, click that yellow button today. And Mikkel will be back on The Scorpion Show tomorrow. Be probably going to get y'all a long video because I won't be doing a new video until I come back from Atlanta. But um, please rate, comment, subscribe. I'll be replying to your comments. Follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash thescorpion. Check out the website, thescorpionshow.com. What else do I need to promote? Um, I think that's it. All right, peace.